so um, um, so the point is to get uh, that uncertainty decreased through a sound regulatory framework uh, that makes uh, more efficient the, 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 the task of transmission planning. And that way the whole uh, picture of the electricity system, generation, demand, and the network in between uh, would be more efficient both from a local perspective but also from a European perspective. <coughs> and um, Eddie, from, from your perspective um, and from what we've heard, how do you, um, what's your experience of, of working with, with TSOs, seeing the regulators, seeing what policymakers are doing, the, I guess, the challenges that you, you face and potential solutions to those? <coughs> well, I think the challenge that, that, uh, that we face in Europe uh, is the same as the challenge that the rest of the world faces, and, and there, thereby hangs a massive opportunity um, and, and a huge learning process that's in front of us. Um, if we're going to agree to cut uh, emissions in Europe by 80% by 2050, and certain other parts of our economies uh, can't really cut emissions, the agricultural sector is going to be very difficult to do that, it looks very much as if we're going to have to have an electricity system that has no uh, CO2 emissions whatsoever. Now, uh, in discussions with, with uh, you know, various authorities in Europe uh, heretofore, we have the following construct in mind. We'll probably make something like 50%